You ever copied something you've seen on TV? As a little kid, I always found myself doing this, but not like normal things that young boys would copy, like D Wade's pump fake, drawing the Disney Channel logo, or even WWE finishes. I'm lying. I was definitely trying to copy that pump fake. But anyways, I used to try to copy cartoons. And I don't mean like logical stuff, like trying to make a Krabby Patty or something. No, 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 no. I remember trying to talk to the TV, trying to convince Mr. Krabs to give Plankton the secret recipe. Now wait, before you unsub, look man, I was a little kid and I always wanted to see the underdog win. And that's because I always saw myself as an underdog. And I just so happened to always find those people on cartoons. It felt like, man, we were late. Now on this day, I was watching Jimmy Neutron. You guys remember him? Top five boy genius, don't at me. But anyways, I noticed Jimmy had this weird crush on Cindy, like, you could tell he liked her and all, but like, at the same time, he didn't like the fact that she was kind of like a genius too. Like, she could hang with him when it came to this genius stuff, you know what I'm saying? Like, Cindy was really like that, don't get it twisted. And for some reason, that made me think to myself, do I know anyone like Cindy? And instantly, somebody came to mind, like, if you turn this person into a cartoon, they probably look just alike. But thing is, I really didn't even like this girl. Well, at the time I didn't, I was just stuck on the fact that she thought she was better than me. Even though, you know, she really didn't actually even say that, but I was really just thinking of the things I should be better at. Like, I was a pretty smart kid, but I never really did any homework or studied or, or really anything to be honest. But like, I was one of those students that like, I just listened to the teacher and I remembered everything. So like, when we took quizzes and tests, I usually always got an A. So I guess that would make up for all the zeros I got on homework from, you know, not doing it. But I mean, I also thought about gym class. Like, you know, in elementary school, how the boys would always play basketball, football, four square, more WWE finishers. But I mean, the girls would always just stand there and do nothing. But it just so happened that she was one of those that did something. When I say something, I mean, she usually would always play whatever we were playing that day. But today was different. I had a chip on my shoulder. I had to prove to myself that I was better than her at whatever we were gonna play today. And today we just so happened to be playing basketball. Now usually when you're having an internal battle, I mean it's you versus you, you're gonna win either way. So for example, if she outplays me, I could just make up an excuse in my head. But some way, somehow, it was almost as if she knew that I had this going on in my head. We were on opposite teams, and obviously you guys know, whenever you guys pick teams, Everybody has to choose who they want to guard. Usually the team captains will say, hey, bro, you got him, you got him, however it goes, man. But this time she goes, I got Anthony. He's not scoring. What? So I decided to try something new. I hope you guys liked it. Uh, it took a long time to make. Uh, probably a lot longer than you guys would ever expect. Definitely the longest it's ever taken me to make a video ever. Um, part two should be out. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this one. Let me know what you guys think should be improved in the next ones. Only going to get better from here. I want to see all you guys' comments. I want to see how you guys feel about this new content. So, yeah, let me know. And I'm um, going to the Warriors game in two days. So, yeah, uh, if you guys want me to vlog that too, let me know.